Hello everyone and uh, thank you for joining me. My name is Sean and I'm back with another astrology video for you. And uh, in this uh, video I'm going to talk about the uh, rising sign of Pisces or otherwise known as the uh, Pisces Ascendant. Um, this is for anybody who was uh, born with uh, Pisces uh, rising on uh, their eastern uh, horizon at the time of their birth. It's uh, not necessarily for uh, one who uh, was born during Pisces season, uh, like late uh, February to March. Um, it's uh, the rising sign uh, basically is uh, the zodiac sign that was rising at the on the eastern horizon at the time of one's birth. And uh, Pisces is uh, co-ruled by uh, Jupiter and Neptune. So um, these individuals will uh, experience the uh, influence of uh, Neptune mostly in their uh, birth chart as uh, well as uh, Jupiter. So um, sit back, enjoy this presentation and um, let's uh, talk about Pisces rising. Well, um, what you have to consider when uh, Pisces is on the uh, first house cusp or otherwise known as the Ascendant, you'll uh, come across an individual who appears uh, dreamy, um, maybe uh, detached from reality, shy, uh, compassionate, gentle. Um, they may be uh, short in stature and usually they have uh, profound uh, eyes that uh, just uh, captivate other people. The uh, first house represents the uh, physical appearance of uh, the individual. So um, Pisces rising uh, individuals uh, often appear otherworldly, dreamy, uh, and it looks as if they're always trying to escape from everyday reality. Um, they uh, don't uh, have uh, as much uh, physical strength as uh, other signs do, um, but uh, nevertheless, uh, they are uh, very uh, spiritual. Um, they uh, have a certain uh, mystery about them that uh, makes them very unique. And um, it's uh, also said that uh, Pisces uh, rising uh, individuals are amongst the most rare out of uh, all those uh, born out of each uh, rising sign. So um, in that regard, Pisces uh, rising uh, people are uh, very special as well. Um, they're uh, often uh, blessed with uh, psychic abilities and um, they often prefer to um, just uh, be by themselves. They don't like uh, large crowds or gatherings. Um, often they like to um, harness the power of their imagination, um, their um, intuitive abilities. And um, it's for this reason that uh, they, Pisces rising individuals, appear uh, aloof, uh, coy, shy, um, yet uh, they do uh, crave uh, harmonious uh, surroundings uh, to uh, keep them uh, happy and uh, content. Uh, they're not very fond of. Uh, uh, boisterous uh, surroundings like parties or um, athletic events, um, anything of that nature. And um, with Aries uh, sitting on the uh, second house cusp, um, Pisces are rising uh, individuals, uh, they, may, they tend to uh, spend uh, their earnings rather impulsively. Yet, uh, they can uh, actually be uh, very uh, hard-working towards uh, maintain maintaining their uh, financial wealth and security. And um, they uh, are able to um, put their uh, energy and uh, willpower into uh, expanding their earnings. Um, Pisces rising uh, individuals, even though they may uh, come across as compassionate, um, often they can uh, be uh, found in the military where they can uh, easily make money. 
Um, they can um, make actually make very good uh, salespeople uh, because of their uh, energy that uh, they're willing to expend in order to uh, expand their financial capital. Now, with Taurus sitting on the uh, third house cusp, Pisces uh, rising individuals, uh, it may take them a while to uh, learn a new concept. Um, however, they uh, are dedicated to uh, learning anything that uh, they find uh, worthwhile in their pursuits or something that they uh, really enjoy. Um, they'll uh, keep practicing over and over, uh, studying the uh, material uh, over and over until they uh, get it right, until they finally learn uh, what it is that they're trying to master. And once they accomplish this, uh, they uh, are able to uh, retain it in their memories for the rest of their lives. And uh, the third house, uh, it represents a communication thought and uh, dealings with siblings. So with the uh, Taurus being ruled by Venus, uh, Pisces rising individuals can actually have uh, harmonious uh, communication with their uh, siblings. Um, they uh, often have uh, beautiful voices and uh, they uh, often lo love to uh, talk about uh, things that have uh, beauty. Um, they uh, love to talk about uh, clothing and fashionable clothing, uh, fashionable uh, furniture, houses. Uh, basically, they uh, love to... Uh, communicate through um, practical, uh, earthy means. And so, with Gemini sitting on the fourth house cusp, uh, Gemini being a very fickle and mutable sign, um, the Pisces rising individuals uh, may have had in, in, oh, excuse me, of an environment they where uh, they may uh, have had parents who were dishonest, uh, who lied to each other, or they may have had uh, parents who were same-sex couples. Uh, Gemini uh, representing the twins, or uh, the number two uh, representing a uh, duality, and um, the Pisces rising uh, individuals like to. Uh, maintain uh, strong communication within their uh, home environment. Um, they'll uh, talk amongst uh, their family members as to uh, what everybody should do or um, just to keep uh, general conversations uh, lively and exciting. Since the fourth house represents uh, the uh, domestic environment and with the cancer sitting on the uh, fifth house cusp, um, the fifth house representing a uh, romance, pleasure, uh, what uh, one likes to do for fun. Um, cancer, um, these, with cancer sitting on the fifth house cusp, Pisces rising individuals love to uh, treat their uh, partners uh, just like their mothers, with uh, compassion, with care, with uh, sensitivity, and um, they may also uh, enjoy uh, domestic uh, chores for pleasure, like such as uh, cooking, um, ironing clothes, um, just uh, taking uh, good care of the home, um, just uh, being, uh, just uh, lurking, looking through um, ancestral uh, charts. Uh, learning about their ancestry, that uh, gives quite uh, a lot of pleasure to uh, prices rising uh, individuals. Now, with Leo sitting on the sixth house cusp, uh, Pisces rising individuals, uh, when it comes to matters of the workplace, um, they can uh, really shine in the spotlight. Um, they uh, love... Uh, how they really enjoy how to uh, make uh, others laugh, how to uh, laugh them, themselves, uh, 
just to have uh, fun in the workplace or uh, make uh, things fun at work where otherwise it can be uh, very boring. But uh, at times, uh, Pisces rising uh, individuals uh, may actually uh, come across as uh, very bossy and uh, domineering, um, especially when it, they uh, deal with uh, co-workers and um, Sometimes they uh, just need to uh, lighten up in this regard, but uh, nevertheless, when it comes to matters of work, they uh, take immense pride in uh, what they do. Um, it's as if uh, their workplace is their own, um, their own uh, theater, their uh, own uh, stage. And uh, if they're in uh, any position of leadership, uh, they, uh, like to um, present themselves in uh, such a uh, dramatic manner. And with the uh, Virgo sitting on the uh, seventh house cusp, um, when it comes to relationships, Pisces rising individuals uh, seek partners who are very practical, um, who possess a great deal of common sense, who are able to uh, help them uh, deal with uh, everyday uh, situations, um, perhaps they need uh, somebody to take care of uh, paying the bills, uh, doing uh, the day-to-day -day chores, um, looking after uh, general details uh, of their home, uh, of their um, relationship. Um, because with Pisces uh, rising being so uh, dreamy, uh, sometimes they're unable to uh, take care of these matters themselves. Therefore, they uh, tend to seek partners who can help them out in this regard. So that way they can uh, stay on top of the game and uh, just uh, live life uh, according to, um, you know, whatever uh, the relationship in did t entails or, um, Yes, anything like that. Now, with Libra sitting on the, the eighth house cusp, Pisces are rising individuals uh, when it comes to matters of joint finances, uh, sexuality, uh, transformation, and with Libra uh, being the sign of uh, fairness, justice, and uh, partnerships. Um, Pisces rising individuals can uh, be very fair when uh, it comes to uh, sexuality. Um, they, uh, when it comes to, um, you know, bonding of the um, sexual sort, um, Libras uh, will take their uh, partners into uh, big consideration. They um, will ask them what they like to do, what they prefer not to do, and uh, the Pisces rising individual re will respect this. And uh, with the uh, Libra sitting on the eighth house cusp, uh, Pisces rising uh, individuals may uh, benefit from uh, getting an inheritance uh, through uh, legal, through just means, and uh, which will bring them uh, great harmony and uh, pleasure and happiness. And with Scorpio sitting on the eighth house cusp, Pisces are rising individuals, uh, they uh, actually uh, have a lot of uh, esoteric knowledge. Um, they uh, can uh, have the ability to become straight, great spiritual gurus and uh, powerful teachers. The ninth house uh, represents uh, philosophy, travel, um, higher knowledge and uh, with the uh, Scorpio here that S Scorpio sitting on the uh, eighth house uh, excuse me the ninth house cusp um, Pisces rising individuals um, can um, enjoy uh, religion and higher no knowledge of the uh, esoteric sort and they uh, have great knowledge on uh, how to uh, be, be powerful and uh, others uh, are often uh, fascinated and 
come to them to uh, seek advice. And with Sagittarius sitting on the uh, 10th house cusp, the 10th house uh, representing a career, um, society, social uh, reputation, uh, Pisces are rising uh, individuals uh, may uh, find a success by uh, becoming a teacher, um, becoming a, a philosopher, uh, becoming a spiritual guru with uh, the influence of Jupiter uh, ruling uh, Sagittarius. Um, they uh, have great luck in uh, expanding uh, their careers and um, they may uh, actually possess more than uh, one job or uh, career. Um, usually uh, Pisces rising individuals uh, go from uh, job to job, uh, gaining the uh, wisdom and experience they need to uh, expand themselves even further, uh, giving up, allowing them to attain even greater success. And um, they will uh, expand their uh, horizons through um, the uh, skill and the knowledge that they gain uh, from their careers, which will uh, enable them to, to become successful. Now, with Capricorn sitting on the 11th house cusp, Pisces uh, rising uh, individuals, like I said, they're uh, very reserved uh, individuals. Uh, they don't like uh, to uh, associate with big crowds all that much, but uh, when they do, they uh, enjoy to uh, mingle with those who are um, conservative, um, who are wise, um, who are mature, um, often they're, they may, uh, those uh, in their social groups w will be older than the Pisces rising uh, natives themselves. And um, they uh, can learn a lot from uh, the maturity uh, and experience uh, from those uh, particular individuals. However, uh, Capricorn, is uh, also a reserved sign and uh, that just uh, reflects how the Pisces rising uh, individual uh, does not like to um, associate themselves all that much with uh, big crowds. And last but not least, Aquarius sitting on the 12th house cusp. Um, it may appear that um, Pisces rising uh, individuals uh, may uh, be detached from uh, spirituality uh, at the uh, unconscious level. Um, however, they, with Aquarius uh, being the uh, sign representing technology and um, social groups and the future, um, they can uh, teach their... Uh, spirituality through uh, means of technology, through smartphones, um, through uh, mass media. Um, Pisces rising uh, individuals uh, need to uh, realize that uh, they are uh, part of the uh, collective whole rather than um, rather than uh, them just uh, being uh, uh, all that matters to the to uh, the universe. Uh, they uh, have to realize that uh, they themselves are uh, part of something greater. Um, and uh, if they uh, learn to uh, accept this, they will uh, gain uh, better fulfillment. Celebrities born with the Pisces rising include Richard Pryor, Alicia Keys, the Notorious B.I.G., Michael Jackson, uh, Ryan Gosling, and Whitney Houston. The tarot card that uh, represents Pisces rising energy is that of the moon. Uh, the moon is uh, perhaps one of the most uh, psychic cards in the uh, tarot deck. Uh, and uh, it's a card uh, that uh, deals significantly uh, with the uh, unconscious mind. Um, how um, one cannot uh, readily uh, perceive uh, all of reality through um, their direct uh, consciousness and instead have to uh, dig deep within uh, their unconscious mind to uh, discover hidden truths. 
Of course, it also depends on uh, what aspects are made to uh, the Ascendant or uh, where uh, the uh, house placements of uh, Jupiter and Neptune are that can uh, alter the uh, energies of uh, the Pisces uh, rising individual. But uh, generally speaking, um, these individuals are very uh, compassionate, dreamy. Um, they have uh, psychic abilities and uh, they need uh, someone who uh, possesses a great deal of common sense to uh, help them uh, through everyday matters. And they don't uh, like to associate with uh, big crowds uh, very much. Often they uh, prefer to uh, live in solitude. So this has been my uh, take on the uh, Pisces Rising native. I uh, do hope that you are satisfied with the uh, level of explanation presented to you. So um, please like, comment, and uh, subscribe to my uh, channel. My name is Sean, and I do thank you for watching. Um, God bless you. Uh, stay safe and be kind to one another. And uh, I'll just close that, this video by saying peace, much love, and namaste. Uh, thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day.